at the time that it was being designed, which was about four or five years ago, um, the, the point of reference was creating a dance piece or a dance concept, choreographic concept, uh, in relation to Paphos, this city, bidding for European capital of culture. And at the time we were working in an artistic team with uh, architects, visual artists, um, uh, writers, uh, actors, musicians, all together. There was one of each discipline, one sometimes two, so there was about 15 of us representing these disciplines and discussing how can we create a concept with different um, events and projects, residencies, that would help this city win uh, the European Capital of Culture and also align it with all this architectural change that the city will go through. So in 2015 I did my thesis research on Paphos Ktima as a specific area and it all did, uh, it, it resulted in the kind of um, the um, intercommunal conflicts of the Turkish uh, Cypriot community and Greek Cypriot community and it was trying to trace out um, or uncover the layers of this community which has been um, slowly slowly um, hidden away um, and through that I created also a map and a new route of the city linking all these areas together um, and from that uh, Erika found out of, the, of, of my thesis research and there was a common theme of what she was trying to do with her project. Um, so I started contributing some of my findings into her research. The sites were, I mean, the city has changed a lot um, because of the European Capital Culture. So now we have new pedestrian zones uh, and plazas and everything. So what the city was and what we knew now is a completely different canvas. Uh, but the idea of the whole project was that it would link with uh, facts and stories of the city. So, it, uh, so that gave us a certain direction of the route. We, we took Kennedy as a starting point because Kennedy Square was always a meeting point for the city from back into the 60s. And now be, it being a plaza, it's kind of reinvented itself and saying, hey, I'm again a checkpoint for the city. Um, and then, uh, as an interest, the introduction of all these leftover spaces from previous uses uh, became um, new places for, well, the question was, what are they now? So, do you, for now, do you use car parks because they're adjacent to now the new pedestrian zones? Let's use those, let's activate them through a performative layer. So area one, uh, sorry, two, area three, those two forgotten car parks, and then the narration within it uh, of the stories to create some kind of uh, help with the, the performance. And then we, we ended up with the Karabasarai at Hani of Ibrahim because that's kind of the new um, cultural building of, uh, of Papos, and also it's one of those buildings that has been forgotten since the 60s. Eight of you, one team, would be uh, the landscape yeah. mover. So you would line up these objects in any way you feel yeah, you want to. Uh, and the keyword behind, let's say the motor behind your lining up, would be the verbs to discover, mm -hmm. uncover, recover. Choreography goes beyond the work that we create. It already starts before we start creating. get involved in the in city planning yeah and how can dance as a very strong non-verbal medium of communication um, create a project where one can connect the city development of this material buildings etc with the actual people that live and inhabit it
code was involved because um, I couldn't think of any other better way of uh, making this project work mm -hmm. yeah, so to be sustainable and for the strong aspect of communication of the different disciplines.
future. Within this big utopia, uh, with our little project, we can maybe offer suggestions. Yeah, could be uh, a playground, or it could be, hence the toys. So the heterotopia came from there, that it's within another area. We create our own little area with new possibilities. Yeah. And it's a bit of a paradox, yeah, because if we look at it realistically, we're still uh, part of this world where it's a neoliberal world which is run by capitalist uh, uh, systems and structures. We are practicing our art, but we're also dependent on it. But nevertheless, we can create our little heterotopia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Embracing. Expansion. Flexibility. Love. Acceptance. Negotiation. Integration. Trust. Grateful. Crazy. Growth. Open. Inspiring. Invigorating. Empathy.